Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Remastered Third Quest. In today's episode, we're going to continue onwards through the Slime Ball Dungeon. So let's get straight into it. And first of all, we are, we are kicking off straight away with a mental room right here. This is some mad shit. <laughs> no, Joey, this is some really crazy shit right now. Okay, so uh, let's go down. I haven't actually gone down yet. Well, now I have, and it doesn't look great. Okay. It just doesn't look so bad. I'm not gonna lie, I'm actually not struggling as much as I thought in this quest so far. I mean, seeing how crazy the first two quite remaster quests were compared to this, I don't know, I, I think this is much more balanced than the first two remastered quests I played. So, good job for making a balanced quest so far. So far. We will see how crazy it gets later on. I mean, we're only at level four, so you know, we have no, we have no idea what could happen. Oh no. Oh no, I know exactly what those things are. Oh, fuck me. I hate these things. <clears throat> okay, so the return of the drunk bubbles. Oh, God. <clears throat> those are the absolute worst. The worst. Huh? What is the worst? Drunk bubbles. These bubbles are where they hit you to stop fucking using whatever the hell they want. Don't! Never! No one use- no! No one can do that. No, well, they can, but no one should. It's a terrible idea. I mean, it, it's fine if you used to write, but the last two remastered quests didn't use them right. We'll see how they- we'll see how well they'll do this time, I guess. Okay, this silver boomerang doesn't actually hurt anything, it's just a magic boomerang. I thought it were like, and I thought it actually had some shit, I guess not. Probably gone to the boss, right? Oh no, look, they are. Okay. Okay. Okay, cool, that's a boss can I was given a magic fairy, which I didn't even know existed, but okay. Oh, actually, it's speeding through this dungeon rather quickly. I don't know, this dungeon, this dungeon isn't as bad as level 3, so that's good. Oh, jeez, why why do you guys have to respawn? Fuck off. Now, I still have a potion I haven't used yet, so... I can't wait for the time we'll have to use it, but for now, I think I should... Oh, God. Well, okay. Um, I guess I'll go to the right and then go up from here, right? Yeah, I kind of kind of I kind of like how this dungeon's kind of split into three, like up here. Oh, oh, oh! It's these guys. I can actually. This guy's not so bad. It's blood bombing him. Oh, oh, oh! Okay. All right. Regret that. I regret that. I regret that. That was a terrible idea. Why the fuck did I do that? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, oh this is a magic thing. I know. I would use the potion right now, but I'm feeling risky right now. This, this is what costed me in the other quests. Feeling risky is a bad idea. I'd never feel risky. But look at that. It, just, it pays off sometimes. Always feel risky. Okay. I don't know. Um, I, I won't believe there's something here until I go up. I don't know. I, I, I had a feeling there was something up here. What's up here? <coughs> I hope you won't use the red candle only to light dark rooms in here. Oh my god. What, what does that mean? What does that mean? I don't even have the red candle. I, I still have the blue one. I think I've I think I missed the red candle. I, I have I have an idea as to where it could be. Well, I got the ladder at least. Now that hit that hint is freaking me out. I don't understand what that means. Well, I got the ladder at least, so whatever. No, but seriously, I don't I don't get the hint. Um, okay. Does that is that a hint to where level five is? Start burning all the bushes. Could that be it? That could be, I don't know. At least these guys will respawn, I mean... Oh! Oh! Bad idea, bad idea. Oh, fuck it, I'm risking it. I know it's a terrible idea to do this, I should've drank my potion long ago, but... I only do it at extreme circumstances, this is one of them. I mean, I can usually come back here, so it's not really that bad. Okay, this room here still is kind of annoying. Well, actually, no, they're in metal now, so whatever's good enough. Okay. 
I fucking called this was gonna happen, so thank god I got prepared. Thank god I came prepared. Alright, um, we've got, we got all the blue enemies here, let's see. What's the boss then? Patra? Oh, it's a rec- oh, it's a- it's a level 2 Patra, oh. Is this a regular Patra? Yeah, it is a regular Patra, holy fuck. Okay, well, he said- yeah, he said the candle is the only thing that can- well, red candle, I guess, instead of the blue one. I have to go search for the red- I still have to go search for the blue one then. Red- red- red, sorry. I always find it interesting how they- how in the original Zelda and in almost every Zelda classic quest, they make the red candle stronger than the blue candle, where- when scientifically proven, um, well, when scientifically it's the other way around. Blue is usually stronger than red in science, but I guess you just don't follow it. Huh? Blue is stronger than red. The blue flame is stronger than red flame. It's hotter. Yeah, I know. Yeah, that's, that's why. But, it's, but in quests like this, you know, it's all the one. They always flipped it around. Oh yeah, because red flame can use it Yeah, but it doesn't... I guess. I guess it means that blue, blue is too extreme, so red, they just make... I don't know. I can't think of a scientific explanation for that. Fuck it. Mate. If you... You know, I have to add the now so I can go get this hot flame. Whatever. Doesn't matter. And if you use the ladder. Yeah. Let's see. And also the boomerang. Okay, draw, we're done with that. And also the sword. Uh, ah, yeah, the shoot sword beans. I don't know, because. Shut up, you can't. I'm gonna take the bait. <laughs> the later on. Whatever that could be. Alright, so I need to go find the, uh, and go find the red candle, so, be right back. Okay, I know where the candle is, I didn't check for level 4 though, but, 5, I mean, but it's fine, I'll go, I'll go wander around the level for a bit, in hopes I can, actually no, there are a few things I want to do, like over where level 6 used to be, there are some things I can do there, maybe, so. <laughs> What's in here? Oh, door repair. Fuck. All right. Well. What? Yeah. No, not really. It's child friendly. That's never child friendly. You know that. Okay. Oh, fucking money game. I hate that. No. I hate the money game. It's the absolute worst. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> it's probably not the door of hairs now. Fuck! I was getting my whistle out. Oh, I do want that money now. I'm gonna just kill everything and get some money. Alright, blow a whistle on the screen. There it is, see in the dark with the red candle here. There we go, now we've got red candle, awesome. And here, so it's just a path to low roll. I don't understand, what's the point? Like, you have, you have a portal there, and you have another portal right there, like, literally just two screens apart. I'm not really sure what the point of that is, but okay, I guess I have to go with that. Not really, the, really though, I actually don't understand that. It doesn't make a lot of sense. <coughs> that might want to be uh, changed up a bit, I guess. I don't know. It just doesn't look right to me. Um... 
Okay, well, I, I guess I don't really... Okay, yeah, I'm getting closer. I hope it's, I hope whatever is there is worth it. Oh yeah, there's another area I can go to as well, and even lower. Alright, there's another hot piece I can get level 2 with the ladder, so I'm gonna go there as well. I mean, I'm already at one hot piece, so okay. One. Yeah, so, you know. Uh, apparently there's also a thing here, isn't it, like on the screen? <coughs> oh yeah, there is, look at that. Oh. Nah, I'm not doing the shovel yet. I'm good. I'm not doing level 6 now. That's skipping ahead a bit there. I think I'm good. I don't break the rules. I'm gonna go to level 5 instead, first, before I can go back there. So, I know where level 6 is now. So that's nice. Okay. Uh, I can go up here, though. Let's see what the hell's in here, because it's kind of just a random spot. I'm not really sure what's in here. Oh, it's a heart piece. Okay, well then. Oh, that's nice. I just it's just a hot piece. Okay, neat. So I guess with that I can go to low vol now. And I can go into that cave and I can go get uh, myself another hot piece, the third one. And then there's one left and I don't know where that is. Well, I really don't I wanna see if I can get to them I just wanna I just wanna see if I can get the ma uh, magic sword before going into level five, if that's possible. I'm gonna assume that's possible. I'm not sure though. Song is oh my god, song something. I haven't never checked in here though. Oh, it's just an arrow shot. Fuck, I don't need that. All right. Where? I'll keep. I'll, I'll fucking. Show. I'll fucking swear as much as I want. Okay, well, that's good for you. Okay. Mon then. Mon then Oh, you fucked it up real bad. Anyway, here right, it doesn't matter. Um, oh, actually. Isn't there like a secret here? No, okay, I don't want- I guess that was in the light world where that was, okay. Alright, let's go in here. In this cave. There, now, this cave is fucking nasty as hell, but there is a heart piece in here, so I'm gonna risk my life for it. This is horribly, this is horribly dangerous. Never do this at home. Don't, don't try this at home. Did you hear them? What? Try this at home, kid. Wait, what's dangerous? I don't know, nothing. Why is it not going? Oh, it's got a piece, and I need one more. So I don't know where the fuck that is. This is like the only cave in the entire damn quest. Like the only actual two screen cave. And and the one in the light world as well, so there's only two of them. Yeah. What did you get? Got a heart piece and one screen below and I got a red rupee there. Okay, now uh hunt for level five. Which I don't know what it is. I really don't. So I will be right back, actually. Alright, so, before we go find level 5, we're gonna go get one more heart piece, and which is actually the last heart piece I can actually get in both overworlds, so we're maxed out with all the health in the overworld. And after that, all we have left is just the dungeon uh, dungeon heart containers and the ball cube, which I will hate, apparently. I don't know, I, I, I mean, I know the ball cube was a terrible dungeon in the remix, uh, was not remix, the remo- uh, no, the deluxe quests, but we don't know what it's gonna be like now. Could be worse, could be better, no one knows, and I don't know why I went in here, because there's nothing even important in there. Yeah. We, no one, we will never know, I guess, I don't know. But seriously though, um, let's go see. Let's go see if it, well, first of all, we can go get our last talk, uh, lock. Yeah. Oh, apparently I already went in here. Oh, I already went in here? 
Oh shit, I already went in here. Whoa, that's a bit that's a bit interesting. Okay, so I, I discovered where I went wrong. Um I'm just gonna hope there's like a portal up there, I guess. I guess so. I can always just do this. Okay, so I know where the last heart container is, and it is in Lost Hot Piece. I mean, it's in a pretty crazy location actually. Not gonna lie, it's in a mental location, a really, really crazy location. So I'm gonna go straight there, we're gonna go find it. Okay. Okay. Okay, so just gotta keep going. I'm gonna head up here now. So there's uh, a couple of places we can go up here. So this video's gonna drag on for just a little bit as I can as I'll go and get that hot piece, but you know. Yeah. It's worth it, I guess. Right. Now I know exactly where to go from here, so that police though. Okay. No, right back here. No. Like screen over. Yeah, this is where I wanna be. Right in here. So super bombs right here. I'll buy. I'll buy two of these actually. <laughs> oh god damn it, draw. Oh come on. Come on. Come on. Right. I'll buy two because who knows? You never know what could happen. Uh, yeah. Oh, come on, bro. Come on. I need, I need to shut up with that. Anyway, so we're just going to head all the way over to the heart container piece now. Heart piece, whatever. Just heart piece. Same shit. <laughs> oh, god damn it, Joel. Stop. Oh, come on. No. Come on. Come on. Okay. Oh, for fuck's sake. Are you gonna stop? No. You should. Come on. Alright, here's where I need to be. You gotta blow this big rock up. Oh my god, Joel. Alright. And here we get a last heart piece we need. Alright, cool. Now we can get out. Uh, we might as well just go into level 5 and then end it off there. So we're going to go over to Laurel and let's go over to level 5. So I know where it is. It's up there somewhere. I guess that, that's very nice. Okay. Oh, well, please. It's just you're never gonna you're never gonna stop. You need to stop. Just get out of here and, and sneeze somewhere else. Just just go sneeze on other places. <laughs> Do you not listen? I said go somewhere else and sneeze. Do you sneeze some shit somewhere else, please? Alright. Anyway, here's level five, so. Here's level five. <laughs> Bubble. Oh, oh, what? That's pretty insane. That's pretty insane. Well, anyway, in the next episode, we're gonna continue onwards through. Fuck, let me do that. We're gonna continue onwards 
uh, into level 5 and finish it up. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.